If you or a loved one are struggling with type 2 diabetes, you should visit the link in the description below. This clinically proven drug-free program lowers blood sugar to a normal level and can completely reverse type 2 diabetes within just a few weeks. Here's today's video. The question, which diabetes is more dangerous type 1 or type 2? Answer by Leanne Heise. Type I diabetes, meaning the patient has no insulin production left so is entirely dependent on external insulin, is a lot harder to control, so needs lots more patient education and self-regulation, especially when compared to type 2 diabetics not on insulin but on oral meds. But type 2 diabetes is often too cavalierly treated both by the patients themselves, but also by many docs. So many are chronically badly controlled, leading to catastrophic complications like heart attack, stroke, limb amputation, blindness, kidney failure, neuropathy etc. Many don't slash want understand that they need not smoke, have optimal blood pressure and serum lipid control, and be frequently examined for eye complications to prevent blindness. Answer by Susan Welsh. Dangerous is a very loaded word. Both types of diabetes have their risks. Only about 5% of individuals with diabetes have been diagnosed with type 1. The other 95% have type 2. In a previous post on diabetes, I pointed out that type 1 and type 2 are not single diseases but are a group of diseases under these convenient umbrellas. Type 1 individual no longer produce insulin. This can happen from injury to the pancreas, disease and iatrogenic causes. Iatrogenic means, no one really knows why they got type 1. Viral infections are suspected but no causality has been found. Their body equilibrium is maintained by balancing their intake of injectable insulin, food and exercise. Illness and stress as are also factors. Because they produce no insulin disruptions and their balance can be devastating. Control is much better now, but lack of control over blood sugars cause side effects and complications for many type 1 diabetics. It is easier for a type 1 to have high and to have low blood sugars if they don't maintain tight control of diet, exercise and insulin. Type 2 diabetics still produce insulin but their body seems to be unable to use the insulin normally or efficiently. Obesity has been cited in a lot of posts. Obesity increases the number of cells that the insulin has to I interact with to shuttle sugar molecules from the bloodstream into the cells. More acreage to cover, less efficient use of the limited supplies of insulin. But this alone doesn't cause diabetes, it is a complicating factor. A type 2 diabetic has a wide range of drugs to help improve their personal production of insulin as well as to increase the sensitivity of their cells to the insulin they do have. They can also be put on insulin. I have serious complications with the diabetic drugs ranging from mild headaches that last forever and going all the way to liver rebellion. Not a pretty sight, so I have been on insulin since the age of 27, and now 59. A type 2 diabetic is less prone to low blood sugars and more prone to high blood sugars. They are also more at risk for diabetic complications, not because their disease is more severe, but because they generally live longer than type 1 diabetics, though that gap is rapidly closing thanks to research and treatment advances. As to being dangerous, both diseases have their danger. You can think of type 1 as a quick and angry type of danger and type 2 as a sneaking, creeping danger. Statistics about diabetes Here is the American Diabetes Association website where you can find out a lot more about the two diseases and how they affect lives. Answer by Alok Kumar You can reverse and control your diabetes. What makes you worried about it? There are two types of diabetes, both are different diseases, but they share same common sign and symptoms. But the cause is 180 degree opposite. Type 1 diabetes, no insulin production. People with type 1 diabetes cannot make insulin because the beta cells in their pancreas are damaged or destroyed. Therefore, these people will need insulin injections to allow their body to process glucose and avoid complications from hyperglycemia. Type 2 diabetes, over insulin production. People with type 2 diabetes do not respond well or are resistant to insulin. Pancreas produce same, or sometimes more insulin than normal body produces. Can you saw that difference in cause of type 1 and 2 diabetes? And between these two diabetes is type 1.5 diabetes. Type 1.5 diabetes, less production of insulin. Pancreas are producing enough insulin to stay well, but that insulin are very small in quantity and unable to maintain normal blood sugar of body. I will share in detail about diabetes and how medical industries trying you to chew their medication to make them rich choices years drug versus diet uh, hello friends if you want to reverse your diabetes drop a mail hello kumar 5 at gmail.com
I helped many people to reverse their diabetes, everywhere around you is a conspiracy to sell medication and drug. And this drug can only cure your symptoms not your actual cause of your diabetes. With healthy diet plan you can throw diabetes completely from your body. Stay away from all drug. They are silent killer. I help people to reverse their diabetes and live drug free healthy life. My name is Alok Kumar, I am diet and diabetes educator. Mail me at alokumar 5 at gmail.com so that I can assist you best to reverse your diabetes completely. Good day.